Okay, so a few things that I forgot to put in this video that I wanted to make sure I let you know about was one, the cost. We spent uh, $767.83 using American Airline, um, and that was for two people, two adults, round trip from Raleigh to uh, Bridgetown. We also, as you saw, rented a car the car was rented through Eurocar on Priceline, and that was the cheapest one that was available. And that was $103.54 for the four days that we had it. And then lastly, where we stayed, we stayed in our Airbnb that cost us $383.86 for the night. So grand total for four days, we spent less than $1,300. It totaled uh, $1,255. Um, so you definitely can get away and get a lot squeezed in and rent a car and visit Barbados. I also didn't mention that we did end up um, converting our U.S. dollars into Bayesian dollars is what they're called. Just because we find uh, when we travel a lot, sometimes we... Sorry for the kids in the background. But sometimes we over tip or spend too much money because we didn't convert correctly. Uh, so it just was easier for us. And goodness forbid, if we actually underpaid someone for their services. Um, a note for you all as well, uh, people in Barbados do not get paid a lot. Uh, they, you pay a lot of tourism tax on your food and, and dining and things that you do. Um, but that money doesn't go to the locals, so I would highly recommend to tip uh, a little more than you usually do to help them out because it's actually more expensive uh, in Barbados than it is in the U.S. to live your daily life. But on the contrary, uh, the locals are making a lot less than the average American. So if you're traveling, make sure that you are a little, you know, friendly with your wallet a few times. The people are friendly. Tourism is their um, number one business and everybody there knows it. And so they definitely take care of you. And we had a good time. Everybody was very courteous. Also, I did not mention that you could travel from where we were in near the south end in Hastings in Barbados across to the North Point where the Animal Flower Cave was in about 45 minutes. So you literally can do the entire island in about an hour or so. Um, so I thought that it was very beneficial to have a rental car so that you're able to go places. Uh, we didn't have to pay very much extra for traveling or things that we had that we did because we had the car. And I mean, honestly, the car was $100 might as well go for it. That's less than what you do, what you pay when you Uber, like say when you visit New York City. Um, so highly recommend that. Again, if you have any questions, just comment, let us know. Uh, and also this is our first video. So if there's something that you think we should change or more information or something you didn't like, I hope not, or something that you did like, let us know and we have lots more videos to come of places that we've gone surprisingly without our children i never mentioned this but there are two jetson and dashel and they the oldest is four and the youngest is two and a half now okay so thanks for watching